Heading across the plains. Right, we're gonna need to get a health pack. It's a bit far up though, some danger. High risk, some danger. Hmm, new car, high risk. Uh, new person, some danger. Okay, so it is a bit dangerous anyway. Let's see if we can heal Chantel up at Elba. Or, yeah, at Elba. Let's use the less fuel to get there. So, here we go. Day two, night. Okay, Alex. You are now faced with floating balls with some sort of tentacle attached. Tentacles poking out, spike balls that are levitating. Are you okay with this? I'm, I'm just asking because I'm gonna ask you to, oh, that's a pickup truck. That's a pickup truck. Ooh, that is tempting, tempting. Very tempting. Well, we're gonna have to go search it first anyway. Come on, Alex. I had a good feeling about this place. Or he doesn't. I didn't really read. Okay. Um. Oh, this is not. It's not gonna go well, is it? All right, enter this car. All right, so it's got plenty of storage. If we find like a bus at the end, we can have like all the companions we could ever dream of. We are going to need to bring some supplies with us though, and we need health packs and all the things. Oh, Alex, you who are stuck behind the user interface, you are going to have to uh, take a little trip around the area. There you go. Oh, whoops, that's, uh-oh, I didn't. Think ahead in this chess game. So Alex is probably gonna die now. Oh, okay. So this ball can be pushed and pulled. So it doesn't really do anything, it seems. Okay, Alex. Um, you are in harm's way of all of these strange creatures and beings. I'm going to ask you to go over here. Check this wreckage when you can. Search it. Oh, the pipe. That is not what we wanted to find. Search this one. First aid kit. Good. That is what we need. Oh, it is very, very tempting to get the pickup truck, but we, too ha we have too many items in this car. Also, Chantal's not doing too well. <sighs> Chantal, can you... Yeah, because this thing probably doesn't have enough fuel either. Should we ask Chantal to bring the fuel to the pickup? You know what? No. No, not going to take the risk. Not going to take that risk. Alex, you pick up that health pack. And uh, let's uh, see if you guys can get out of here. Does that sound like a plan? Sounds like a plan to me. Chantel, you're going to have to drive. There you are. Very sorry about that pickup truck though. That would be uh, kind of cool. But fresh car here. And if fresh means what uh, I think it means, I mean, the word means kind of new and, you know, not old in the rest of the world. So we'll just have to hope that it is correct. High risk, high risk, some danger, high risk. I'm gonna go for a new car. Let's see if we can find a new car. All right, here we are. Day three at dawn, that is a new car. You get to have the health pack and you get to use it as well. Good. Alex, 
you get to uh, bring the fuel over here and then fill it. No, that was Chantal. Sorry, Alex. Uh, she, well, well, she's done doing her thing. Um, well, that was done. That one has two moves. Let's not forget about that. So, Alex, you're just going to have to go over here. Oh, you're going to go over here, actually. Well, and turn. Oh, shit. Alex, fill this car up, please. Oh, no. Oh, that is my cat. Ruining the game for me. Thank you very much, Ellie, for putting your head on my mouse button at a very crucial moment. You are such a cat. Well, Alex is not doing too well at this point. This car has a lot of fuel. This thing has two moves, so it has one move and then an attack if I go over here. So let's go over here then. And turn. Damn it. Right, um... Get fuel out of this car. Okay. And turn. Oh my god. You can get more fuel. Because that's one turn. That means we can also get the last of it. And then move away. Yeah, it is going to blow up, actually. But, thankfully, Alex, see, one move, attack. So we have to go in the back. Also just put the fuel in the back and run off, or drive off, I mean. Uh, and I'll turn. Whoa! Well, what a stroke of luck. Fill it up. Fill it up, Alex. Enter the car and drive off. I'm hoping the car contains something, uh, something useful. Like weapons and stuff. It does not. What the hell is that? It's a, it's a fence? Like a, a picket fence? Well, anyway. Turn this car on. This truck on, I mean. And drive off, Alex. Into the sunset with you. Okay, um, I don't think we're going to survive this without more people. So, oh, that's going to, oh, it's also going to use all of our fuel. So fuel is more important than people. It's like Mad Max in the, in the wasteland. Right, more fuel it is then. I mean, it lowers our survivability rate, but we can't really get across the country on foot, can we? Didn't go very well that first time. Ugh. Yeah. So, that's a lot of creatures. That's, that, yeah. That's a lot of creatures. Matidas. Um, yeah, just start walking. See if you can find any fuel. Let's get what we came for. It, it, I was just talking to himself. Okay, everybody. There's no everybody. Or are you talking to the Matidas? Right, and just turn right there. Oh my god. You seem to be surrounded, Alex. Let's see if you can find what you're looking for. Imagine finding some gas all the way out here. Amazing. Yeah, well, good for you. Fill it up on your next turn. Mm. Closing in. They are going to wreck this car, aren't they? Okay, so fill that up. That's not really going to be enough. And you can't really safely go around any of these creatures. Because if you move here, they're going to attack you. 
here they're going to attack, here they're going to attack, here, here. None of these slots are safe. So, you should just get in the truck and keep driving, I say. That is going to come back to bite us in the bum. Oh, but we do get our little boss fight level in Springfield. <clears throat> Excuse me. Uh, I don't really think that Alex is going to survive that. Not really. Day three is sunset. That is quite the roadblock. And you don't have any friends to help you this time. Right, whatever this is, let's assume it's, oh, it's a shield. Gives you more armor. Interesting. Well, um, you, my friend, you do not have many choices. You are going to have to go to this car and check for fuel. And then you're just going to have to ram your way through until your car explodes and then walk to the next level. So, check the abandoned car for goodies. Very important to check abandoned cars for goodies. Another shield? Are you kidding me? That's not what I need. Should have checked this thing when I was near it. Okay, uh... Around and round we go. Oh no. Well, it, it, it's good that it's not all happening in real time. Because... I would be deader than dead a long time ago. This thing has two moves, so if I walk over here should be safe, but this thing is going to be too close for me to do anything else. However, I can't really go around because there's another thing. So, one, two, three. Um, yeah, and I can only stand here to be safe because this thing will move one, two, bang, or one, two, bang. Yeah, so I'm going to have to go back to this other duplicate shield and end my turn. To be strategic. I like this. This could be... Uh, this game, actually, could be a good board game. Not really, maybe, uh, because there's a lot of other characters are bound to die all the time. So, I guess maybe the, the cooperative nature wouldn't really work in a multiplayer environment. So it's, it would be a single-player board game, perhaps? That uh, doesn't really sound as good. Okay, so one, two... Oh, right. Um, you can get back in the car now, can't you? You can get back. You can get to the dumpster. See, this going with one... They can't move diagonally, can they? Or can they? I can't remember. Let's go this way. Yeah, no, they can't. Good to know. Um, yeah, check the dumpster, please. Just in case. Ugh, are you joking? There's nothing useful here whatsoever. Right, Alex. Time to sacrifice the truck. See if you can get out of here. Uh, shield bash. Well. Here goes nothing. Ram it. Damn it. Now the truck's not doing so well, but at least we're on our way. The horde is closing in. Cool, we did survive the planes, but things are not looking too good when we enter the mountains. There's a lion. There, there were some lightning people dressed as lightning bolts. Uh, there was someone dressed as sort of like some cave fungi from the moon. 